I'm an American, and I know that a lot of the people who watch my channel are also American. So if you are American, you know that today is the 4th of July. Now, the U.S. is a fun place because almost every state has a designated state reptile. So, I thought it'd be fun to make a video today showing each of those states state reptile. We got a lot to go through in a short amount of time, so let's get into it. Let's start with Alabama. Alabama red-bellied turtle is the state reptile of Alabama. It's an endangered turtle found almost entirely in Alabama. It's known for its red underside. Arizona's is the Arizona ridge-nosed rattlesnake, which has a range more so in Mexico than Arizona. California. Now, California has the desert tortoise, which is also common in southern Arizona. I actually took care of a sick baby desert tortoise when I was younger. California also has a state marine reptile, which is the leatherback sea turtle. Colorado's is the painted turtle, which, in my opinion, is one of nature's most beautifulest turtles. It's famous for its stripe patterns. Florida. Now, Florida is weird because it's the only one that has three state reptiles. The primary is the American alligator, of course. Their saltwater reptile is the loggerhead sea turtle, and their state tortoise is the gopher tortoise. Next is Georgia's. Now, Georgia is also the gopher tortoise, which is known as a keystone animal. Basically, what that means is that the animal benefits other animals around it by its actions. The holes the gopher tortoise makes are used by 360 other species of animals. Now, I do want to stop here and say from this point on, a lot of states share reptiles. I'll try to toss in facts for each, but just be aware that officially many states do this. Now, Illinois. Illinois is also the painted turtle. The fact that this turtle is the state reptile of a mountainous western state and a Great Lakes state just shows how widespread this turtle is. It is the most widespread turtle in all of North America. Kansas. Kansas is the ornate box turtle, which is also a common pet turtle here in the United States. Louisiana. Louisiana is also the American alligator. Louisiana, especially the Cajun people of Louisiana, have a deep history with the alligator. Today, alligator hunting is a very big part of the culture in southern Louisiana, as documented in various TV shows and documentaries. Maryland. Maryland is the diamondback terrapin. Now, terrapin is a term used to describe a turtle that lives in brackish water. Basically, it doesn't live in fresh or salt water, it lives in a mixture of both. I actually spent a portion of my childhood living in Maryland, and this reptile is actually very important there. The terrapin is even the mascot of the University of Maryland. Massachusetts. Massachusetts is the garter snake. My family come from Massachusetts, and this state is filled with garter snakes. I heard stories of how you can find them pretty much everywhere, bushes, grass, anywhere you look, you can find a garter snake. While this is true for much of the country, for some reason garter snakes in Massachusetts have this weird kind of bond going on. Michigan. Now Michigan is an old friend of ours, the Painted Turtle. That makes three states so far. However, I will tell you there is one more state that also has the Painted Turtle as their state reptile. Mississippi. Mississippi, also known as the state with the hardest to spell name, also has the American Alligator. That is thanks to the southern part of the state, which stretches into the Gulf of Mexico. That area is notoriously swampy. Missouri. Missouri is the three-toed box turtle. A trend you'll notice is a lot of turtles and not a lot of snakes. Despite snakes being everywhere in the U.S., Americans do have a certain level of fondness for turtles, myself included. Nebraska. Nebraska also has the ornate box turtle, which it shared with Kansas. The ornate box turtle is known for its yellow marks on its shell. Nevada. Nevada is also the desert tortoise, which is native to the Sonoran Desert, located in Sonora, Mexico, Southern Arizona, and parts of California, and the Mojave Desert, which is located in parts of California and, of course, Nevada. New Jersey. New Jersey's is the bog turtle, which is not a turtle you hear about often, and that's because, sadly, it is critically endangered. It's also rarely spotted because it spends most of its time hiding away in mud. New Mexico. New Mexico is the New Mexico whiptail lizard. Finally, another lizard. Whiptail lizards are awesome. I commonly catch them while out herping. Their long tail sticks out like a sore thumb, making them relatively easy to track down. New York. New York's is the common snapping turtle. Yep, many people don't know that snapping turtles are not just found in swampy southern areas. They're found pretty much everywhere east of the Rocky Mountains, which is a lot of dang places, including, oddly enough, New York. North Carolina. 
Now, North Carolina's is the Eastern Box Turtle, arguably the prettiest box turtle. I'm sorry, but just look at the gorgeous yellows and tell me this is not an extremely beautiful turtle and like not the most beautifulest box turtle. It just is, look at it. Anyways, Ohio. So Ohio is super cool. Um, Ohio did the Eastern Black Racer. Now, black racers are pretty common. They're similar to the snapping turtle in the fact that they are found everywhere east of the Rocky Mountains. They get the name Racer because, well, they're fast. That's that's pretty much it. Like, somebody looked at it and said, Well, man, that's a pretty fast snake. Look at that thing go. And it was like, yeah, I'm just going to call it a racer. That was it. Oklahoma. Oklahoma, I love you for making your state reptile a lizard. You're great. Thank you, Oklahoma. The common collared lizard at that, which is one of the few lizards that have a really bright blue color. That's only in the males, however. The shade of blue also kind of matches their state flag, so that might have been why they chose that. South Carolina. Now, South Carolina is the loggerhead sea turtle. Unlike Florida that had three state reptiles, South Carolina thought that the loggerhead was cool enough to be its only representative. Tennessee. Tennessee is also the eastern box turtle, and I can't argue with that because if you look at the eastern box turtle, it's kind of self-explanatory. Once again, look at it. It's beautiful. Texas. Texas has two. The main one being the Texas horn lizard. Horn lizards are also sometimes called horny toads, but they're not even close to being toads. That's really common out here in Arizona. Like everybody calls them horny toads or horn toads, much to my pain and suffering because they're not toads, they're lizards. Anyways, the second one is the state sea turtle, which is the Kemp's Ridley sea turtle, which is the rarest sea turtle on the planet. I actually want to make a separate video about this, so look out for that eventually. I am going to make a video on these guys. Utah. Now, Utah is the Gila monster, not the Gila monster, Gila monster. The G makes an H sound for some reason. I don't speak Spanish. Um, I've talked about the Gila monster a few times on here. I also filmed a few Gila monsters in some of my vlog videos, one of which you can see in the top right. They're one of the only venomous lizard species on the planet. I think there's only like a handful, like one or two, three maybe. Um, don't quote me on that. Vermont. Vermont is the painted turtle. Yep, we hit number four. It's the final state. It's the final state that uses the painted turtle. And just to highlight how spread out this turtle is, those four states were Vermont, Michigan, Illinois, and Colorado. Colorado is quite a long way from Vermont. What a well-spread turtle. Virginia. Virginia's is the Eastern Garter Snake. Now, what makes the Eastern Garter Snake different than the Standard Garter Snake? Well, nothing. Massachusetts decided to choose the entire group of snakes as their state reptile, while Virginia decided to hone in on one, spe eh, one specific species, which is the Eastern Garter Snake. There is no Standard Garter Snake. There's all kinds of types depending on region, coloration, and so on. West Virginia. West Virginia is the timber rattlesnake, which I had the pleasure of getting face to face with. Um, obviously, it would be behind glass, thankfully for me, but I filmed it. And if you guys want to see that, look in the top right. And in this video, uh, I uh, filmed the timber rattlesnake. Pretty cool. Wyoming. Last but not least is Wyoming, who designated the horn lizard as a state reptile. Similar to what I said for garter snakes, Wyoming chose the entire group of lizards as their state reptile, while Texas singled out the Texas horn lizard as theirs. Now, that concludes the state reptiles. You're probably thinking, huh, it feels like you missed a few states, and that is because I did. Only 28 states have official state reptiles. So for the states that don't have one, it's okay, you don't matter.